At 6.23 p.m. on Tuesday in the French overseas region of Guyana, Ariane 5 takes off for its 250th flight. After two launch delays in recent days, the European launch vehicle set out on a 34-minute mission. Aboard the vessel, two passengers, a telecommunication satellite for British operator Inmarsat and another satellite for the Egyptian government. A historic flight for the Ariane space programme 40 years after its inception at a pivotal time for the European Space Agency. On Wednesday and Thursday, ministers from the 22 member states are due to meet in Seville. The purpose of the meeting to approve a 14.3 billion euro budget for the next three years, a 4 billion hike from 2016. Europe wants to remain competitive in the space sector, especially in regards to the US and China. They are currently developing their latest rocket, Ariane 6, scheduled to be operational in 2020. Ariane 6 is a race against the clock and a race with our international competitors. We have more and more competition, especially from the famous SpaceX. We want Ariane 6 to take up the challenge and have a launcher which is going to be extremely competitive. A launcher that can fight it out with SpaceX on the market. According to experts, SpaceX remains the go-to model with its reusable launch system. Other companies, such as Amazon's Blue Origin, are also entering the fray.